Hello everybody! So for those of you that don't know, when I made my pumpkin decorating video and I made a Severus Snape pumpkin, that was actually an entry into a one of these October challenges hosted by Stacey at Stacey Stories and I won! Which was so exciting because I was really proud of that pumpkin but what was also really exciting is the prize I got. It arrived today and I am blown away by how amazing it is. Stacey is a really big Ed Gallen Poe fan and so am I and she all the things that she picked up for her prize winners were from the Edgar Allan Poe Museum which she'd visited I think a few weeks before the start of Spooktober and guys this stuff is amazing okay I'm just making this quick I just want to show you guys and just like because it's it's amazing I got a little Edgar Allan Poe badge with his face on it and I love him he's such a little grouch I'm so cute. And then a pencil that says Edgar Allan Poe Museum on it with like lots of birds and ravens. Well, presumably they are all ravens. Yes, all ravens. I probably will never shop in that because it's just too nice. And then I got a postcard with the raven on it. This I thought was just the coolest thing. It's a quotable notable. So it's an Edgar Allan Poe shaped card. And then on the back it has stickers with like quotes and stuff that you can stick inside the card. But just an Edgar Allan Poe shaped card, guys. If I can be persuaded to pop with this, I already know who I'm going to give it to, but I might not. I might just want to keep it for myself forever. Then I got an Edgar Allan Poe bookmark, which is really cool. On this side it has his face and the and a heart, which I think is a reference to the Telltale Heart. And then on this side it has a raven, obviously. That's what he's best known for. And I love bookmarks. I have such a big bookmark collection, so that was right up my street. And I got a Nevermore notebook on the inside. It's just plain like lined paper, which is good because I hate when I get notebooks that don't have lines in them because I have such skew handwriting. Like, all of my notebooks have to be lined and just, yeah, the cover is just gorgeous. The Raven and the Nevermore and I saved the best for last. This I just saw and immediately I was like, that's just too cool. It is a printout <clears throat> of Annabelle Lee, which is my all-time favourite Edgar Allan Poe poem, in his handwriting on paper that's been made to look like old and worn and feel like parchment. This might have just become my most prized possession. This is so insanely amazing. And I'm guessing that they have multiple poems available because it comes in this envelope that says Annabelle Lee by Edgar Poe in prose writing. So I'm guessing that they have more than one available, but I am just so happy that I got Annabelle Lee because it's one of my all-time favourite Poe poems. Well, it is my all-time favourite Poe poem, and, like, Stacey didn't know that, and she got me, like, the perfect one. So, Stacey, thank you so much. I am blown away by the amazing gifts that you got me, and I'm just so happy and excited right now. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, and subscribe to Stacey because she is, like, the nicest human being ever. I will leave a link to my Snape pumpkin over here, and... I'm not sure if you can link to other channels' videos, but if you can, I will leave a link to one of Stacey's videos down here. Go watch her because she's so nice, she's so sweet, and she makes really good videos. And she has a skeleton that she dresses up, and it's super cool. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I got, and I will see you all again very soon. Bye!